When it comes to geothermal power sites in the country, we always have in mind the Olkaria Power Cascade, famously known for its ability to generate electricity using steam. Kenya's geothermal capacity is however set to increase as the geothermal development company embarks on drilling new wells in the Menengai crater. Menengai is said to hold a potential of generating over a thousand megawatts of power, a move that will greatly help in meeting the growing power demand. The project to cost 80 billion shillings should be ready in the next three years. With the interest that we have seen from outside, I think we will be able to start the whole process. Drilling a single well currently costs approximately 600 million shillings, but this has now been slashed to about 300 million shillings after the geothermal development company acquired its own rigs. Our plan is um, slowly to increase the number of rigs that are owned by us and then uh, phase out the, the contracted rigs. The company is also exploring for geothermal energy at Silali, Paka and Korosi in the Rift Valley and has already begun surface exploration and expects to put up supporting infrastructure by the end of this year. Now what you see behind me is one of the two rigs that have been bought by the geothermal development company in a move that is set to reduce the cost of sinking a well by up to 50%. Now, if plans by the geothermal company to acquire even more rigs is anything to go by, then the government will no longer have to spend any more money in hiring a contractor for its geothermal plans. Denis Otieno, Citizen Business, at the Meningai Crater in Nakuru County.